Adventures, welcome back to Automania. My master Automar. And today we are playing Skyrim. This could be the last episode for tonight. I've said that before, but this is truly the last one. Oh yeah, Blade Sword. Uh, Blade is the name of the group. Oh wow, you you change quick. Now I can actually take this stuff, and she won't give a damn. So we're gonna take all these lovely Andrew potions. Dad sent me a text asking if we were okay with the story. That's the only thing I've heard from him in some time. Okay. So we're just gonna take this gold, since she doesn't mind if we take it. Coin purse, 47 gold, wow. Actually, how much money do I have after selling? 2,500. Yep, yep, yep. So I should be able to teleport fairly near to where that place was, or to the, to the place we're going, Kynesgrove. Which is... Oh, no, it's over there. I, I could go to Windhelm, and then just go, yeah, I'll go to Windhelm and directly south of there. So I need to go to the stables and white run and fast travel from there on out. Central location of Skyrim is managed. <clears throat> yeah, white run, white run is pretty much the trading place of Skyrim because, as it says here, it's pretty much in the dead center of Skyrim. So lots of trading routes. <clears throat> so I need to go to Windhelm. So I think I just hop in. Oh yeah, I can just hop in without having to go talk to him. I want to go to Windhelm. Boop! Sit back and enjoy the ride. Sit back and enjoy the ride. Let's all my count. They say a big old palace was there by Ysgram himself. <clears throat> Alchemy labs can be used to combine ingredients into useful potions and deadly poisons. So apparently in this game, you can make a poison, you can pick a pocket somebody, put it into their pocket, and they start dying from poison. No idea how that works. Okay, but we're going to go directly south from here to get to the dragon burial site, kill the dragon, then continue on our wayward son. There'll be peace when you are copyrighted. I really can't send that because of copyright. Oh, that's something I need to do. Oh, no, I don't have my shout. Or, sorry, I have shout, but I don't have the shout that I want. There's a shout where I spit out frost, and it deals initial damage, but then also deals damage over time. A lot of damage over time, which I need. Also, I was supposed to go back to High, high Guard. He, I was supposed to go back to the place with the great beards. Hrothgar. I was supposed to go back there, but I didn't do that, apparently. Which I need to do, cause yeah, I I got it. I know. I'm here to kill it for a reason. Now the big bad dragon we saw at the beginning of the game, that is the dragon that is going around resurrecting all the others. As you can hear him and see him, there he is. So we're gonna go right over there. There's a path here. I kind of went the wrong way. But yeah, we're good to go. We got plenty of good stuff. We got one end. Oh, there's a jail here. I think that's a jail. Hey, buddy. So he won't attack us. He's They just kind of did this as a marker to make sure we know where we're going. Uh, they intentionally designed it that way. So right now, we're just getting up. I wish he would start resurrecting now. Oh, crap. Where do I... Where do I... Do I have to go all the way around? No, I can just go up here. Hopefully. Hopefully. Eh, eh, eh. Come on. I can cast countless magic spells. And you can't climb a freaking rock. There we go. Oh, that's right. I was supposed to go around from this way. Oh, I like that voice. I don't think I can hit you. Nope, I can't hit him. And here is the boss we are fighting. Let's get started. Oh god, look at all that damage! I mean, the damage he's dealing to me, that's a lot. But oh, Jesus. I paused that just in time. I can't be in front of him. Oh, you missed! You missed! So right now we're just poking that aside. 
I shouldn't need to use another potion. I should be able to kill him without... Sweet, killed him. What do we have? Dragon bones, I can carry a lot more now. And 190 gold, cool. Yeah, and now watch, as I absorb his soul... I told you, I'm Dragonborn. Are you deaf? Do you have a bit of, bit of a hearing disability? Yes. Hence the amazing sword in my hand. Even though anybody can get that, really. Yep. Do you want to talk now? Yeah, pretty much. So I think if I just ask her who she is. Yep. A very long time ago the blades were dragon slayers, and we served the dragonborn, the greatest dragon slayer. For the last two hundred years since the last dragonborn emperor, the blades have been searching for a purpose. I'm quite out of energy. Our purpose is clear again. We need to stop them. Yeah, pretty much. What's our next move? That should cut right to it. Probably that big dragon. Yeah, what about the Falcon? Bandits, thieves. If we could get into the Thalmor area, the problem is that place is locked up. I'm sorry, I'm just. So how do we get him? Meet me back in Riverwood. Keep an eye on the sky. Okay, now we actually have to go back to Riverwood. Now, but before I do that, I'm going to go to High Hrothgar. High Hrothgar, get a wee bit of a thing on my hair. Learn a new spell. Or, I already know Fusro. As soon, as soon as I turn this horn in, it's going to create into Fusro Da, the final stage of Fusro. Or Fus. It goes Fus, then Fusro, then Fusro Da. And I hold down T. I'm on a mouse and keyboard right now. And so, to use my shouts, I have to press T. And the longer I hold it, each stage per, it uses another stage. So, if I just tap T, it's Fus. If I hold it for a bit, it's Fusro. And pretty soon, if I hold it for as long as it goes, it turns into Fusro Da. Which is awesome. So now I have to go over here. Over here? And... No, that's not right. To go here. Right there. There we go. Excuse me, sir. Yes, Andre. Arn gear. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, Wolf Guy, my favorite one out of them all because his name is Epic, man. Epic, like me. So, force, balance, and push. You gotta force a balanced push. Fus, ro, da. And now, oh, I can't use it right now. We would speak to you. Stand between us, prepare yourself. Oh, yeah. Who can withstand the unbridled voice of the prince? So now they're just going to yell at me and tell me how much handsome I am and stuff. There's another wave. Ah. There are multiple waves. I think there's like four waves, so it's kind of annoying. Then again, it it is a huge part of the game.
Sounds like Nosferatu. Ah! Okay, this is the last wave, so there are three waves. No, not rock! Well done! Thank you. Except for my ears, they're kind of blasted. Full show dot, epic man. Cool. And as you can see, the cooldown timer on it is much greater. Like, it's not even, the beams aren't even separated yet. Like, now they are completely separated. That took a while. Because right now my quest is to get into the Theramore Embassy. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Sorry, I just got a text about Christmas. So I'm going to go to Riverwood. Also, at the very beginning of the game, in the first episode, I, I, I chose to go with the Stormcloaks. I could go with the Imperials now, but I want to go with the Stormcloaks. Um, and now, I could actually do a quest to invade Whiterun with the Stormcloaks. Because Whiterun end ends up kind of leaning more towards the Imperial side. And if I join the Stormcloaks, I can attack Whiterun. And if I'm an Imperial, I end up defending Whiterun from the Stormcloaks. So it's a good time. We try not to... Oh, by the way, if you kill somebody's chi you stabbed him in the face! What do you think happened? Okay. Oh, is that chicken eating the cloth I put down? You're weird, man. You're weird. Alright. Sleeping Gentleman, gotta go back, talk to Delphine. Then we're good to go. Okay, let's go back into the wardrobe. Turn on here! Whee! Oh no, it's just a, ray, a creepy dungeon. Creepy was the word I was looking for. Nothing else. Oh, wheat. I need some wheat. Oh, we got the wheat bit of wheat here. Oh, chest. Oh. Hello, father. Hello, son. That's also something I need to do is sell. Sell the scrolls that cost 500 a piece. If I sell them to a foreign guard, I'm pretty sure he'll buy them for more than usual. That would be a bad idea. I'd be too likely to. Yeah. Gotta skip past this so I can end this episode. Yeah, it's really short, but now I kind of have to. I'm sorry if I skip if I skip past that really quick. Nope, no question. So I'm gonna save. I'm gonna do my outro very quickly and as quietly as possible. No, screw that. Screw that. So, anyways, it's only not even a 14 minute episode. I apologize. Hopefully, you can understand that it's gonna be really awkward with my dad in here. I can't commentate with my dad here because that's just awkward. He doesn't even know I do YouTube, but whatever. So anyways, thank you all for watching. And as always, I'll see you in the next video. Farewell, stay epic! Woo!